Alrighty, in just a matter of hours, one of the last pandemic era assistance programs will be coming to an end in North Carolina. SNAP benefits, what used to be known as food stamps, saw boosted funding during the pandemic. SNAP benefits roughly benefits roughly 1.6 million people in the Tar Heel state. It's about one in seven residents. The typical SNAP household will see monthly allotments drop by about $95. But for older Americans and bigger families, that difference could be hundreds of dollars a month. It puts pressure on food banks who will now need more food and volunteers. One local nonprofit spoke on the misconception of those who need the services most. Many of the people that we help are actively working, but they're living paycheck to paycheck and they just simply cannot get caught up. And the prices of groceries and rent are going up and you're not getting salary increases that coincide with that. Now, possibly some good news here. The USDA says SNAP recipients will see more than before the pandemic, and that's due to cost of living adjustments. Ben, Sarah, I'll send it back to you. Well, that's a little bit of good news just because inflation just over the last few years, but still putting a lot of folks in a tough spot. Kia, thank you. All